whole of the city centre itself looks a little bit dated, um, and marred away especially. Um, I know other areas of the city centre is having work done, which hopefully will be completed soon. But a marred away is, goes from like the train station all the way to Royal Parade. Um, I guess people coming to the city centre when they arrive by train, coach, it's the main footfall through to the city centre. So it looks very tired and dated at present. So the investment, yeah, can't come soon enough, I'm sure, for all of us. It's just wonderful that we had all this money given to Plymouth City Centre for, as an investment and then it all came to a halt. And then I think as businesses, we were so worried that that money then could be taken away or not used to the advantage of what it needed to be used for. So it's, yeah, it's such good news. Outside my shop, we're going to have an amazing play area. So that's really exciting because we're a baby and children in the shop. So having the great big ship that's going to be built there. I mean, the whole thing is about five size of five tennis courts, I think. I bring footfall into the city centre is what we're hoping, uh, which I'm sure it will, because it's a, a big family village hub. So obviously that's going to bring a lot of family into the city centre to shop. The scheme for Armada Way is absolutely amazing. We need to do something different to attract different kinds of people back into the city centre. It's not all about shopping anymore. It's about creating a good experience so that people can come in and of course shop and eat and drink at the same time. I think the scheme for Armada Way, it's a lot of money, it's a big investment, it's long overdue. It's actually fundamentally important for this city. It, most town centres across the country are struggling at the moment. We've got to be very grateful for this city council for doing their best to actually do something which is hugely positive, not just for the people of Plymouth, not for just for visitors, but for huge swathes of future investment, as that's what we need in this city. The city needs to turn.